That's a really good question. I thought, I thought about wearing it, wow. you know, like, uh, like, you know, bling. Um, thank you, wrestling. Pretty good. Thank you. you. You roll with the punches. No, thank you. Uh, I love the hit. Frank Castle is in my bones. You know, like Frank Castle is in my bones. Like, you know, I, I can't look. With the success and the accolades you received last year with especially those three films, I'm just curious if you saw this series as an opportunity to do something different and perhaps a challenge as well. Yeah, definitely. I'm, I'm always looking to challenge myself and keep myself on my toes and expand and not to stagnate i suppose and you know i the yeah obviously those three previous projects have been very very distinct and different and but they they were all rather expressive there was all, there was a lot of um emotional expression going on and i think what was attractive to me about this character particularly was a kind of a, a more internal um expressiveness rather than it being too he's a stoic guy he's a kind of internal mormon police officer it's not um he's not a musical theater writer he's not uh, angsty superhero and he's not a televangelist he's a guy that's just trying to be a good man trying to do his job and trying to be as ordinary as possible and not rock the boat you know and i found that to be quite compelling actually in contrast and but outside of that it's, it was really the story itself that attracted me and the, the themes that it deals with and the 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 creative people that were uh, attached to making it